Well, gee, Paul, these planes look pretty snazzy. What they really that? are. They really are. We can show you another one. Yeah. Hey, guys, welcome to Flight Test. We are at Middle Tennessee State University and the aviation department. Now, obviously, if you're going to be going into general aviation, the first thing you need to do is learn how to fly. And this is actually the course that we're going to be showing you guys today. Uh, this is called your professional pilot concentration. Correct. Yes. Awesome. Essentially, we take students through uh, different levels of flight instruction. We offer private pilot okay. uh, instrument commercial, multi-engine, certified flight instructor, certified flight instructor instrument, multi-engine instructor, and tailwind. Now the really cool thing about this program is you can come to this program with a passion for flight and they will take you all the way up to the point where you can actually go into the jets. Regional airlines Regional. is generally the first step and then you have the majors or the legacy carriers which would be you know Delta, American Airlines, United. Now as far as efficiency goes, you guys streamline time-wise yeah. that whole process. How do you do that? The first three certificates that we have, the private, the instrument, the commercial, they're under the FITS program, the FAA industry training standards. It's a proficiency-based, scenario-based program. So this is where the journey starts. What is this plane right here? So this is our primary trainer. So this is a Diamond DA-40, very similar to a Cessna four-seater. Now most of the times I see a flight school, I see a lot of old Cessnas laying around. These aren't old airplanes, are they? Right. It's a pretty advanced cockpit. Right, yep. It's a, what's called a glass cockpit. So once the pilot actually goes through the private training, they're working on their instrument, but they need to get the commercial, they go to a different plane, correct? Yeah, the private's all done in the DA-40. The instrument's all done in the DA-40. And then the commercial, certain parts of it are done in the 40 and then it's finished up. There's two strands that we call them that happen in the aero because it has to be done in a complex aircraft. What makes a plane a complex aircraft? Uh, it has to have a, a controllable pitch prop, it okay. has to have flaps, and it has to have retractable landing gear. And this has so all the, of them? It has all of them, yeah. Fantastic. What's the purpose why you want to get a student in this as they're getting closer to the commercial? Well, essentially, if someone gets their commercial certificate, after they receive that, they're, they're able to go out and make money. They're able to get hired by somebody. The idea of it is to get them into an aircraft that has a little bit more complex systems. So we take them out, we run through those systems, we run through commercial maneuvers. There's a lot more checks in the checklist. Well, from my perspective, if I was a student, I'd want to get to the commercial as quick as possible because at that point, I can still continue to grow as a student, but now I'm making money. Sure. After this, they move on to the Seminole? They move on to the Seminole, yeah, that's our twin. No Joe, problem. nice to meet you, my friend. Nice to meet you. So what is this plane right here? So this aircraft is a PA44-180. It's a Piper Seminole. The biggest difference is that we have two engines now instead of one, but still, just like the Aero, it has retractable gear and multiple other systems that we work with as well. What's the time frame when the student walks through the door, they actually get to finish off with this plane? So if you go and get your prerequisite classes done, history, math, et cetera, stuff like that, when you attend MTSU starting flight labs, it can be as quick as two years you're going from private all the way up to MEI right. and then all you're doing through your time is just building that time as soon as you have your time typically the students just graduated and they're already applied for a job and have a job at the airline and speaking of jobs uh, the airline industry is in desperate need of jobs absolutely the placements incredible and the fact that students can get through this course so quickly build their hours make money along the way but then also be ready for a job in an industry that's ready to receive them that's a really great thing Yes, absolutely awesome. Guys, I really can't thank you enough. Uh, one thing that we really love is with our community, we want them to dream bigger. And you guys can take people from their very first flight, even if they've never flown before, get them to solo all the way through their private, all the way up to their multi-engine rating, and set them up on a great path to be able to go into the professional world as a competent, skilled pilot. Friends, I want to thank you for watching. Thanks for being part of the family. Thank you for the opportunity you've given us to explore careers like this. Check out our other videos around MTSU, and we'll see you next time.